Adam Cheadle, our referee, as our two fighters get ready to break into MMA for Lindsay Garbett as a professional. Stephanie Essenza trying to welcome her in a, uh, a rude fashion to the world of MMA, looking to spoil her debut. They touch gloves and we're underway. Very traditional boxing stance for Lindsay Garbett, as you expect. So it's going to be when the first takedown attempt happens from Stephanie Essenzo, as we see how Lindsay Garbett is able to react to that and that change in the changing from the sport of boxing to MMA. And now Garbett gets back out. Just nice. look at the musculature on Lindsay Garbett. Couple punches land to Essenzo. And again, something else that you might not see in boxing is that running in. A nice hand there from Essenza takes Garbett down. She's on top and looking to finish here, landing punches to the head of the former world champ. Good punch timing by Stephanie Essenza. And again, landing another good shot, showing the power that is Lindsay Garbett. She just bullies her way and has Essenza on her back now, but that was an excellent shot by Stephanie Essenza. She caught her on the counter, and uh, but now Lindsay Garbett on top and looking to, to kind of revenge some of that damage she took. Just about 20 seconds remaining now in this first round. This is our first professional fight of the evening and the first professional fight for Lindsay Garbett who is up against the cage now. Stephanie Essenza landing some good knees to the legs. Now 10 seconds remaining in the round. Some elbows there to the side of the head. And there is some blood now on Stephanie Essenza. So the nose bleeding on Essenza now. Lindsay Garbett, a good solid first round for the first fight in her MMA career. And uh, Lindsay Garbett gets set to renew hostilities here in round number two of this three round fight. When normally you might see that Lindsay Garbett would come out with a little reckless abandon, but that counter punch by Stephanie Essenza in the first round has really limited that ability to rush in because of that counter punching ability. And again, big strikes coming in from both women now landing strikes. And uh, a nice combination of kicks and punches there from Garbett. Essenza doing a good job of landing some punches of her own. And it, it seems leading with the elbow there was Garbett and now lands a couple strikes and looking for a takedown of her own. Well, on takedown would be very dangerous here because it allows Lindsay Garbett to start letting those fists again, showing the professionals are very patient. Nice work by Lindsay Garbett using the punch to close the distance. Needs to get those hands locked in behind the legs of Stephanie Essen Essenza, pardon. And a good takedown. But Essenza again landing in a good position to be able to counter the effect. And that's a huge up kick. A vicious up kick from Stephanie Essenza. Bounced the head back of Lindsay Garbett. But Garbett, uh, no stranger to taking damage to the head as a professional boxer, went right through it and continued to control this fight. Well, it's a position that Essenza has worked countless times in the gym, but rough now as that arm is around the neck. It's not quite locked in for a rear naked choke, but the head is being controlled. So you're gonna see some shifting of weight. Good work by Essenza attacking the hands, making sure that Lindsay Garbett can't get any grip and any work on the rear naked choke. Garbett now looking for the rear naked choke, does have the one arm under, but Essenza stopping and preventing her from getting that grip and holding it down, but now Garbett switching to the other arm, trying to get that under the chin and secure it on the other side. So Garbett with the back of Essenza for the last minute or so of round number two and landing some punches, both fighters landing punches, although the ones from Essence are not gonna do much damage from that position, but uh, showing the judges she's still okay by throwing punches from the top. So they come out and touch gloves for the third and final round here between Stephanie Essenza in the black Jayco trunks, the Hayabusa shorts for Lindsay Garbett. Two 
Jeremy, we knew what Stephanie Essenza was bringing into this fight, certainly as both a striker and, and on the ground game, but I'm really quite impressed with the totality of skills that we're seeing from Lindsay Garvin. Well, and she spent a lot of time getting ready, you know, trained for three years before finding a, a, an opponent. But again, this is a very tough fight because both are landing good shots, and those are some nice body shots from Lindsay Garbett. But every time that we think that Garbett's getting into the boxing, getting her striking, Essenza lands a great shot, just like she did there with that overhand left hand. Lindsay Garbett finishing off the takedown, trying to, to kind of better her position here. But another vicious elbow followed up by a, a, another one here from Stephanie Essenza to the side of Lindsay Garbett's head. And posturing here is Lindsay Garbett trying to take away that ability to use those elbows and try and get some separation. But a nice takedown from Essence immediately countered by Lindsay Garbett, but wasn't able to get the separation on the over on the throw on the body lock. And now a good position for Stephanie Essence, who really gets her first opportunity to work from the top in this fight. In that far shoulder, trying to steer away Garbett, though pushing through that Jeremy getting up and driving Essenza to the, to the cage. And you watch Essenza, anytime she feels like she's in trouble, she's gonna crank on that on that cross face and, and it's uh, similar to a neck crank. It's a way to counter the, the attack here. But uh, now with the legs being let go, she's looking to crawl to the back and she does. And so she's gonna be in a good position here with 50 seconds to go. But just as we say that, Lindsay Carbett sneaking out the back and now landing some strikes of her own. Nice exchange of punches there. And again, Garbett comes in with the kick. Essenza feeds her a fist. And now it's Garbett with Essenza up against the cage again. They're trying for the drag takedown and winding up in a bad position as a result. And just 20 seconds left. So you're gonna see, again, Stephanie Essenza is gonna have a big flurry here when she sees the, here's the last 10 seconds. And as, as asked and answered, Jeremy, 10 seconds left, and Stephanie Essence are coming in with elbows and punches, winding up on top. What a fight between these two, as Stephanie Essence and Lindsay Garbett go the distance. And that may have won her the fight. It, it's tough, because the first two rounds were so close, and I think Essence uh, hands up in the air. She's very happy with her performance. And again, that third round definitely belongs to Stephanie Essenza. I don't know who won round one and round two. Uh, again, that's why they pay me to be here and not to judge. And now, the official decision brought to you by Print Calgary. The winner by unanimous decision. In the blue corner, Lindsay! Garbage. No doubt in my mind, Stephanie Essence won the third, so it must have been the strength of rounds one and round two that pushed Lindsay Garbage to win.